we're rolling the dice big time as to whether it's going to be dry there. I mean, it can't even decide whether it wants to be a sunny day or whether it wants to be rainy. So Seth and I were so determined to go on a ride today, and and then we got our stuff ready, and I was like walking out down, walked downstairs and ready to leave, and the big thunder struck, and I heard rain, and uh, but we're not ready to admit defeat. <sighs> All right, we made it, and it's looking pretty good out here actually. This is my goal. I just got this new camera, this RX100 Mark V, right, Seth? Yep. And I want to get, I want to start learning how to use it. So I'm hoping to get a lot of like third person, just play around, get third person shots, and help Seth also get some clips for his upcoming video this week. Um, and obviously, while doing that, I want to ride my bike. So, yeah. We are off, and man, is it nice out. We got so lucky. We were so bummed earlier, and now we're actually getting to ride. So. <sighs> We're gonna go up the trail session this section a little bit and then in the end I'll probably get out on a full ride with the GoPro. <laughs> <laughs> We're out of breath. <laughs> we just straight up climbed, you know, just right out the gate, climbed up a really big hill. Whew. But it's a fun little section. Have a uh, little jump right there. Really little jump. And then a pretty fun section right here though. And uh, uphill, we got a nice little chattery, really wide open, fast section. Whew. Yeah, let's hit it. All right, admittedly, that got a little crazy. That was like right on the cusp of out of control, but I mean, that's just what this section begs for. Seth's gonna go up and give it a run now. I'm stoked to see what he does. Stop. What do you think of this section? Pretty fun? It's pretty fun. This is good. And it's a low traffic area, so it's a pretty sweet spot for him to come get like specific shots, you know? It's, it's really wide, but the actual burned in trail is, is ni nice and narrow. I don't know if I'm gonna do it until I look at it. Right. So I'll take a look. All right, Seth's talking about trying a 360 off of this. There's no, it's like hardly any lip. It's just a straight, you know, a, a straight yeah. shot off. So it's like kind of funky, but we'll see. Dude. Ah. You okay? Yeah, I twisted my leg. In what way? In a way that... Oh, your knee is shaking. Are you okay? Sit down. I'll grab your bike off the trail. Ah, did my water bottle stay in? I shouldn't have tried to do that after not riding for so long. Weren't we just talking about this last night on a yeah, live stream? We were. We were just talking about this. We are like two of the best examples of people for the old saying like, do as I say, not as I do. I know. It's like we, had, we barely rode all winter and then we just jumped right back into just... Not only that, we barely rode all winter, then we got on live stream and warned our entire audience about it and then we did it. Yeah. But hey, the water bottle stayed in. Just the more times I hit this section, the more fluid I feel, the more in tune with this bike I am. And man, it feels good. All right, now I'm gonna take you guys up. Got the gimbal on, and I'm gonna go back up. I'm gonna go a little bit further and get a POV foot uh, shot of this whole run. All right, we're up here at the top. I'm playing around with my shock a little bit because I just got it back from Fox and it kind of felt like it was packing up a little bit on the last downhill. And what I mean by that is 
the rebound wasn't fast enough so it was compressing and then not having a chance to uncompress uh, to rebound before it hit again so it was kind of packing up and getting shorter and shorter along the downhill so upped it by two clicks i'm gonna give this a go see how it feels let's rock a lot of people blow around that corner Yeah, hey, let's uh let's get a couple clips of this. So we just got a ridiculous shot on Seth's camera and and it's so true like we both I almost hit it on the left side and he almost hit it on the right and then we're looking at it we're like that's exactly why you get the service plan at Best Buy right there so you can get that shot. This is why you get the service plan. like one percent away from being the end of my camera oh, but just simply the start of another one because you paid the hundred bucks oh yeah i would have gotten a new camera but yeah, i'm saying like that's today why you get the service plan when you're using it professionally all right we finished with our clip getting that was super fun and that was just like one decently length section of trail that's it we've just been on that the whole time it's super fun i love doing it you get more and more comfortable with the trail you get to do to figure out different ways down it and um, you get to do it faster and faster and faster as you get more comfortable with it so uh, if you guys like that style of filming let me know now that I have this camera I think it's gonna look way better I'm really excited to get it into editing and uh, now throwing this thing back on and we're gonna go maybe we're a couple lucky we get to come out here and pedal around Pisgah for work what the hell did we do to deserve this my friend Whew. While we're on the climb, how's everyone doing today? I think this is a Thursday video, probably in the afternoon, so you're either wrapping up the work day or maybe already done if you're on the East Coast. Ah, hope everyone's doing well, having a good week. I'm planning to get out on some rides this weekend. We're gonna get let Seth go blind down this and we're gonna tail him. This is Spencer Gap and, it's amazing. Like, and Seth I've is riding here, blind. Lived here a year and there's so much stuff I've never ridden before because I've been traveling so yeah. much. Yeah. Is your lens clean? Not really. Okay. All right. Not that it's gonna matter, because you're gonna be eating my dust. <laughs> All right, I don't know <laughs> what Holy shit, he's going fast. He is hauling ass! You are going so fast! Oh my god, you're going fast, dude! Dude, that trail's so much fun! I know, right? There it is! Yeah, dude, nice line! Oh, hell yeah, dude. 
<laughs> you just ran it blind for the first and last time ever, dude. You never get to do that again. It's a special, special moment. I felt like you were riding real good right there. I'm feeling good. Yeah. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and continue because we've got some, some, um, got just, some, uh, just wilderness pedaling here. Okay. Yeah. You know it's a Pisgah ride when? This thing. You all right? Are you choking on a bug? You good? Wow. How much better does it get than this? I don't know, dude. Let's hit, let's nuke it. All right. Yeah, it's fat. It's going to be a little burmy. And then towards the end, dude, you're going to hit it. Glad I just roughed it out and climbed that. Yeah, me too, man. Way to stick with it. I'm glad we went for it and came out anyway. Oh yeah. Really, 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 really stoked on that trail. So you kind of liked it? I kind of liked it, you could say. <laughs> I think moral of the story is if you're ever considering going out for a ride and you're like a little uncertain or you know it might be it might be drizzling there, it might be a little wet, just go try. And, we, uh, we and we were and ready apply. to have to. We were ready to get to the trailhead and see just rain and turn around and go home. Yeah.